Google Plus has recently rearranged a little bit of how your profile displays. You'll notice that the cover photo that you see here is still going to be the same size as we've had it before, which is 2,120 by um, 1,192. Uh, that is great for displaying on TVs and other kind of larger browsers and screens. So when somebody visits this profile area, they'll now see the entire profile, whereas before, or the entire photo, the, as before, it would be approximately the last one-fifth maybe of the image, 20%, the bottom area, would display, and that would be about it. So to see how I got mine to move, let's go take a look at, first of all, I started in Keynote, and I made a simple background that I was using previously. And the reason I made mine animate is because now that the whole thing displays, I really would like people to see all of what's there. So I, I created a presentation in Keynote, and I'm simply just going through and animating these various elements individually. Then I went to export it as a QuickTime video file. Afterwards, I am using GIF Brewery, which is available in the App Store. And with GIF Brewery, you can convert that QuickTime file into an animated GIF. Once you have installed GIF Brewery and you go to launch it, it will ask what QuickTime file it is that you are trying to open. I've already started one, so I'll open the same file that I was using earlier. But you just simply browse for where the QuickTime file is that would end in .mov. This is great if you're on Mac. I would imagine that there are similar programs if you're on Windows. And you'll see that this is the way GIF Brewery is laid out. When you go into the GIF properties, you'll see a window that looks like this. You can change how long you want it to play based on how many frames. You could set the delay that makes it go faster or slower. So I've made mine out to 250. So it's a little bit longer than what the default was. I also dropped the GIF color size down. You'll see that I reduced the number of colors and I dropped it to I actually did mine at 192 and I told it to improve the GIF quality and web dithering so that my file size would be under um, 10 kilobits. So I have mine down under 10 to upload it into my Google Plus settings. And to change the photo to be able to upload it, you simply go to your profile, you click on change cover, and you browse for where you've saved the file from GIF Brewery. You would go to upload and then add a new photo this way. So that is the way the GIF Brewery works. That is the way that, that Keynote works. And again, just to create that GIF, if I didn't mention it earlier, on GIF Brewery in the top right corner, I click on Create GIF and the file is set for me.